Hey, Karen. Great day here in Tala, Bellator Fan Fest. Tell us a little bit what's going on. Yeah, so we're just having a fa fan event today. Just uh, we're 11 weeks out now from the fight. Just under, sorry. And uh, just for opportunity for the, I suppose, the people and the fans that maybe come to the event or get to meet, you know, the likes of Heist Gracie, John Cavan, myself, Leah, Peter. You know, it's, uh, it's brilliant, I think. It's good. Uh, Obviously, the, the lose here is unreal, you know. So it's, um, I think it's a, it's a good opportunity for people to, you know, uh, get get a bit, bit, bit of a buzz now coming up to it and that, you know. So yeah, you just mentioned there, seeing your face on a lose must be a strange feeling. Uh, it's a mental one, man. Uh, I used to, I used to get the Lewis to uh, train before we started driving, and, and uh, now, you know, now I'm on the side of it. It's, it's, it's mental. It's yeah. mental. I mean, obviously, you know, you, tr you, you, sh you strive to get to where you are now at Bellator and keep going, but I mean. That day, you don't, you, you can't expect that, you know. And actually, one of the lads, he uh, said it to me, and he was like, "Yeah, you're on the, you're on the Lewis," and I was like, "Go away!" And he said, yeah, "I just thought it was a poster, you know." Next day, he sent me a video, and it's <laughs> me in the side of it, you know. So uh, yeah, it's brilliant, it's brilliant. Yeah, and then we're here today, obviously, to promote the event in September. Dublin, you're back in action for George Sazu. What, what are your thoughts on that fight? Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Um, I mean, he's a, he's a tough lad. He's um, he had a good fight with my uh, teammate there, that Ilias, that comes over back and forth to SPG. Um, it was a split decision and it was a good fight, you know, he showed, you know, um, strike and wrestling and to strike with a good striker like that, you know, so I'm expecting expecting a, a good fight and uh, really looking forward to it. Yeah. Well, it's helped when you, as you said, he fought with Ilias, your team, you kind of lean on Ilias for a bit of information? Big time, big time, yeah, I mean, um, even just watching the fight, um, I can, you know, kind of see what he was throwing and, you know, he, he, how he fought against him and stuff and obviously Ilias is not trying to take him down or, and then he wasn't trying to take Ilias down, you know, either, you know, so he was ha happy to stand with Ilias and uh, yeah, just took a few things from that and definitely get a bit of advice off uh, Ilias, you know. You obviously got a win that night, he's stoppage, dislocated shoulder to uh, Abutu Kara. What, what was your thoughts of that? Were you a little bit disappointed with how it ended? Um, I tell you what, actually, I, um, on the night it was like, I hadn't a clue, you know, how it went and it was, it was, it was a mad one, it was a mad one, so it was a bit of a sweet feeling, but actually, I didn't. I watched the back. Didn't see it, but it's actually a mate of mine. And uh, my brother watched the back, and he goes, he said, "Watch this." And it was on the double leg when I was on the double. I like, clamped down, and it's. I've done it in my fights before, and uh, actually against John and I, uh, clamped down, roll under on the double, and his shoulder hit the mat. So it wasn't, you know. So when I watched back, it was like, right, okay. Look, I know he he didn't slip in a banana. He's in there fighting someone. But when I when I uh, watched the back, I was like, no. Actually, do you know what? That is a win. You know, I was the one that done that. If, does that make sense? Yeah. Obviously, not the way I want to win, but um, bittersweet, I suppose. But I'm, I'm looking forward to getting the next one yeah, under the belt. You still got the win, and you've, you're on this uh, momentum now. You become a firm fan's favourite in Dublin, especially. I know you've been around Bellator last yeah. few years, but the last two events really have elevated you. So your main card last time, you're on a Lewis. What's the last kind of two years been like for you? Uh, it's been brilliant, to be honest. And I mean, Bellator, like I mean, they really got behind me and. Uh, you know, um, I think really since that November fight, I had the tough fight with Jordan, and, and uh, you know, it was, it was voted the top uh, in the top ten, but top ten Bellator fights of the year, and um, yeah, it was it was brilliant. I mean, and now to see this here and how much they're pushing me, and um, yeah, I'm delighted to be honest. And what, any other plans past September for the rest of the year or early next year? Um, I'm I'm not sure. I'm just kind of to be honest, I I just focus on each fight because I don't like to look too far uh, ahead you know because I feel when I look too far ahead I'm not focused on what's in front of me and uh, I know it's it, that's the obvious but um, yeah I'm just focused September get the win please God and uh, yeah focus on what's after that then you know and the whole draw are coming out again really. oh big time yeah the whole draw are coming out and um, yeah big time I have, a, have a, another big following coming out again and uh, yeah I mean as always you know they're always uh, the loudest and and uh, yeah, I'm really looking forward to it. And, I mean, it's an extra reason in there, isn't it? I mean, the whole town behind me, and yeah, I'm very, very grateful for the support. And just finally, a word on the man who's here, which is today, Peter Queeley. Massive fight against Benson Henson, one of the most experienced names in MMA. Yep. Just more than that fight, it's very exciting, isn't it? It's a big fight. I'm uh, really looking forward to it, to be honest, and it's huge for Peter, you know, it's a massive opportunity. And uh, I think, you know, Peter's style really, you know, um, I think he can really catch him with the blitz, blitz and shots. And, I'm really looking forward to it, to be honest. It's, uh, it's going to be a great fight, yeah. So, Karen, best of luck in September. Thanks for today. Thanks a million.